Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be having a look at the fur coat fuzz from Orange. What? Hold up! We've already done that haven't we? Yes we have. But this time let's see what it sounds like on bass. So we are running through the Ashdown ABM 500, um, taking a mic from the 115 cab, I'm also taking a DI, but when I'm going straight into the interface, straight into Reaper, and then I'm playing through the ESP LTD B205, which I absolutely love, and then everything, every bit of dirt will be coming from the fur coat fuzz. Now, I'm not really a fuzz player. I do like um, a more distortion tone for my bass. However, I have been playing around with this pedal for a bit and I do quite like how it's sounding with the bass. So um, with that being said, let's jump into some samples.
So one of the unique features about this, as we've said in previous videos, is the um, octave function. Now, I found myself personally that when you're playing with the octave to turn the fuzz down a bit. So like now, yeah, you know, we've got our fuzz on about three quarter and um, obviously the octave's not engaged, but that's on sort of like a quarter. Now, if we do engage that octave now, doesn't sound too bad. Yeah. So, and then if we crank the octave but leave the fuzz where it is. It's just too, too farty for me. It's a bit too, it's too much. So if we turn the fuzz down, so now we're on about three quarters octave and a quarter fuzz. Um, that ju it just sounds a bit better to, in, to my ears anyway. Um, other than the octave, the, the whole pedal itself is just sublime for bass. If you want them doomy, stonery, sludgy tones that, um, you yeah, know, the likes of uh, Sleep, that sort of genre of bands, um, absolutely insane sounding thing. I love it. I. I am tempted to buy one myself. Will I use it that much? Possibly not, but is it worth having in your arsenal? There are times where you just wanna sludge the fuck out, then yeah, I think it probably is worth it. What, they retail at what, 130 quid if, if that, so, so you can get a second hand market, get them cheaper than that. Yeah, quite like it and if you haven't seen our guitar video, uh, it'll be around here somewhere um, outlining the actual more ins and outs of it and how it sounds on guitar. It sounds beastly on guitar, by the way. Absolutely insane sounding. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it from me. All right, well, uh, take it steady and I'll see you next time. And if you're new here, please drop a like. Um, it really helps the channel out and subscribe as well. Come back for more. All right, thank you very much. I'll catch you next time. In a bit.